Hello everyone, in this video we are going to be creating a unique zoom animation for any product you have and this is a unique way to showcase your product to attract eyeballs and clients who are ready to buy from you. So before we get into it, just in case this is the first time you're on this channel, I highly appreciate you hit on the subscribe button and also like this video just to support this video. And if you're on the free version of Canva, I have a free link in the description box below that can help you upgrade to Canva Pro for free. So make sure you are checking that out and without any further ado, let's jump into today's video okay so fantastic before we dive into it make sure you have a photo of your product okay and also make sure it's uploaded in canva the dimension we are using is a 1080 by 1350 to set it up make sure you're coming to create a design and you can just search for instagram okay so search for instagram and as part of the list you should see the portrait so instagram posts into bracket portrait select that and you should have something like this okay a blank canvas like this so upload your image like i said and what you need to do for the first time is increase the size okay so you can see this is what we have and i'd want to maybe keep it like this on the first frame okay so once i keep it like this on the first frame all you need to do is come in here and duplicate the image okay so then we can maybe zoom in more and just move it to where you want it to be okay so something like this which is cool then what you can just do is come down here and duplicate the page okay then you come to the third image and just move it maybe where you want it to be okay so something like this so over here i want to focus on these capsules so i may zoom in more and place them somewhere here okay then the next thing we are going to do is to duplicate it again okay and you can just click and just move it anywhere you want okay so i'm going to do like maybe five pages okay which should be okay for me where haven't we touched on okay so i think maybe we have with the soup okay so this is what we have at the moment okay now we, let's go back to the first page and what we are simply going to do is we can just add any text of our choice okay so i can press t okay on my keyboard and um increase the size and you can maybe list or give the name of your product so i'll i can see the ultimate okay makeup bundle so makeup maybe bundle okay or maybe face cleanser or whatever whatever product you have you can just list it over here okay and um, make sure you are tidying up your text okay so i'm just going to keep everything just like this okay and the bundle can join the makeup okay then we can select it and make it bold and also make it white okay just like this then we would reduce the size so we have something like that okay lovely javelin aha uh -huh. so you see what we have at the moment then we can go to the second page so the second page come into element and search for zoom okay once you search for zoom you should see this in here if you're in the free version of canva make sure you're finding the free version of that okay so you can look through i don't know what it's called though let me see so zoom target okay so maybe zoom target okay and you see a lot of them definitely you should be able to find the free version inside of canva okay so on the second slide okay i can maybe target this one and i'll make the color white then i'll just copy my text okay come in here and paste it here and i can see syrup okay syrup and one of the things i did before this tutorial is i went into chat gpt to fetch you know some benefit of um, how do you call it makeups and all that so i can maybe copy a few ones in here so you can also go into chat gpt and this is the prompt i used i'm making a video on makeup on the makeup bundle product to write a list of features and benefits of authentic makeup and it gave me that okay so you can also do the same so i will first of all reduce the size and i wouldn't make this bold okay then i'll just copy everything in here okay then make sure you tidy up your text okay nicely so just tidy it up and you can reduce the size if you want okay but just the main point is making sure everything is looking good okay so that's what you have to do okay so this is what i have at the moment and i think i'll even reduce the size of this a little bit okay so this is what we have at the moment okay 
now we can also duplicate it for this one as well okay so this one and i can put another one also over here okay and this can be for the cream i'll just say cream okay and the cream for the benefits we are just going to pull our chat gpt inside again and um, we can just use smooth and blendable textures okay so that's all i just want to see over here okay so that's for the cream all right then we'll come to the page three okay and we want to target the capsule so what i'm going to do is i'll just copy and select any of this okay so i'll copy them come here and paste them here so the zoom target we are just going to place it on the capsule okay and the text can come down here all right and i can just say capsule okay no not capsule okay yeah not caps cool but capsule then with this i'll just come back into chat gpt and look for what fits it okay so formulated to put you blah 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 without fading says uh, yeah maybe let me just use this okay then i'll select or and paste it okay so this is what we have at the moment okay now we would want to move on to the next page so i'll select this hold shift while i click on the others and control c to copy and come to page four and i'll paste this over here okay then we can just say i don't know what this is but we would say uh formulated scrap okay so from later scrap something like that and we can put this here something like this and the text can be here okay so let's find another thing okay that supports it so support ethical and sustainable beauty by choosing okay so we just we just use this line okay so that's all they will come here and paste them all right then the last bit i think the last page matches with what we have over here with page two so we might just switch it okay yeah so i think we'll switch it to this lotion yeah we have over here okay then select it select select copy all come here and paste it over here okay so we bring it here select this and i can put the lotion over here and we can just come back into chat gpt and pick what you know matches with it so let me see makeup results okay so versatile makeup product that's useful okay so i'll just say use for multiple purposes offering flexibility okay that's what i'm going to say okay so we paste it over here as well okay so now that we've done that we realize that we have all five pages set up but the issue is that this is not a video at the moment even if we come to share there's no option for video or automatically it doesn't tell us it's a video okay so these are just images we've created so come to the first page and select this okay the title then come to animate okay with animate you can choose any animation of your choice but i'm going to use the ascent okay so you can choose ascent and the speed you can reduce it okay lovely javelin okay so now that we've done that then hover your cursor in between you know page one and page two you should see the option to add transition click on it and click on match and move okay so once you click on match and move set the duration to 1.0 okay then click on apply between all pages then select your first frame or your first video come to the top which is the edit timing okay which means that it will take four seconds or this page will last four seconds on screen before it switches to the next one so make sure you're coming here and you're changing this to three no not three let's say two okay then make sure you toggle the apply to all pages okay so when you do that it applies the effect to every page okay now that we've done that if we play it you can see how it will look so you see what we have lovely amazing amazing okay so you can see we have page five then let's add page six i think that the last thing we can do okay to page six is when we can actually reduce the size of this image okay so we reduce the size okay of the image something like this okay uh -huh then we apply the same transition okay and make it 1.0 all right then we can just 
we can just delete this okay delete the text we have in here so if we are to play it again this is how it looks Now that we've done all of that, I would want us to add a background music to make it lively. Okay, so what we are simply going to do is come into, where do we go? Where do we go? Okay, so into element, okay. And under element, you just search for nature, okay. Then make sure you are searching through to find audio, okay, audio over here. Okay, but if you scroll down here, you should find audio, even though I feel like it will take me a long time to find okay come to apps sorry come to apps and you should see audio in here okay then all you can do is allow it to load then search for nature okay so you search for nature and you can see this is what we have okay, that's not what i want okay so something like this can work so we'll just drag and drop it in here okay and if you are to play it this is how it looks okay amazing 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 so we can see that it takes a while for this to start so we can just trim it and move everything here okay so that when i play it starts automatically uh -huh. okay lovely lovely so it ends abruptly so what we can do here is we can select the audio come to audio effect okay and the fade out we can increase it okay so how about increase it to maybe two seconds okay so the while it's getting to the end it fades out and that will make it better now to download this or to get this make sure you're coming to share then come to download make sure it's on mp4 okay then make sure all pages are selected then click on download okay so once you click on download canva would load everything and you can have your video done now one thing to avoid is the copyright okay copyright so if you're on canva pro you can avoid having copyright when you've posted this video okay and to do that make sure you come to share and um, before you do that okay before you download you see this your one design music license will be connected to your account so you can connect all your accounts okay so you can see i've connected my african geek account in here okay so i will just have to make sure i'm connecting make sure you have your account connected in here so that you avoid any copyright infringement okay so yes i hope you found this helpful i hope you found it very easy to follow if you enjoyed it make sure you're hitting on the like button if you didn't like it make sure you're hitting on the like button again and if you have any tutorial you want me to make also leave it in the comment section below the name is benjamin ocean remember there is no limit to creativity and i should see you in my next video